St. Bernard Parish is one of several parishes dealing with hardship as a result of the oil spill. While officials concentrate on how to help unemployed fishermen, one local radio station wants to help the kids. Power 102.9 is hosting a hip-hop concert where 100% of the proceeds will provide playground equipment for Violet Park Number 2. And here with more on that is KKND Program Director LeBron Joseph, and uh, we're going to be talking to, uh, to uh, St. Bernard Parish President Craig DeFaro in a minute. But first of all, LeBron, this was your idea. Yeah, it, it was my idea but uh, to, to do the concert, but, but our general manager, our market manager, David Smith, um, as things are starting to develop, we have four radio stations over at Citadel, and uh, his whole thing was let's drive something towards helping the folks however we can. And with Power 102.9, it's a station that caters to young people. Uh, it's a hip-hop station, and hey, this is how we can help. Let's bring some national artists in. Let's do some things with our local artists, and the proceeds can go to help some kids. And why did you choose the St. Bernard Parish Recreation Department? Well, the parish is Coastal Parish. It's where both of the transmitter sites are for both KKND as well as KMEZ. Um, but we owe them. And, and we've, we, we feel we have a debt to our coastal parishes in their time of need. Uh, we, can, we contacted the, uh, the parish president's office and Greg DeFaro said, hey, look, I got a park you can help. Uh, it's in Lower St. Bernard, where the fishermen, where the oilmen, where their kids play. Let's do that. And so tell us about the concert that's going to be at the House of Blues. Uh, J. Cole is, is the headliner. He is uh, Jay-Z's young artist on Rock Nation. Uh, Sony Music and, and Rock Nation said, hey, look, here's who we can provide. Uh, the Cali Swag District is also a very popular young group uh, with a big song, Teach Me How to Dougie. Uh, um, <laughs> you know you may know how stuff. to Dougie. I don't know how I, to Dougie. I don't know how to Dougie. <laughs> My daughters know how to Dougie, but I think you can Dougie, Sally. Uh, also, um, so you're, you're, you're reaching out to young people to come out and have sure. a good time and help other kids That's in exactly the process. what it is, but there's some local artists that stepped up as well. Yeah, everyone knows Juvenile, and that's cool, but uh, uh, amongst the brightest of the young stars here locally is Courtney Hart, and she said to perform this morning. Morning. Courtney's outstanding. Oh, wow, is she ever, and we're going to be talking to her in a minute, but right now I want to talk to Parish President Craig DeFaro, who's joining us on the phone right now, I believe, and good morning, Craig. Good morning, Sally Ann. How are you today? I'm doing great. What good do you morning, think Craig. about this concert and how it's helping out? Well, you know, it's, uh, it's always refreshing to have, uh, have new ideas and, and anyone helping uh, to step up to, to really give a little bit of uh, comfort to, uh, you know, the children and families who are behind the scenes on this incident certainly uh we don't want to forget about them so we're, we're happy to have it i thought maybe you'd be uh doing your show in hip-hop this morning <laughs> it's, it's kind of a, a little plug uh well so this is going to help a parish that has really been a hard hit describe what's happening right now in st Bernard parish and how you're dealing with this oil crisis well you know sally we've been talking now for four and a half years after the storm um that we've been working to rebuild and recover uh, and this this oil crisis has really just taken the wind out of so many people's sails that uh, you know we're we're fighting to keep the momentum going. Uh, we've been fortunate to this point. We only have about a mile and a half of of our land that's been impacted by oil. Um, you know the good news is we've been able to take about two hundred fifty barrels out of the water before it actually reached land uh, in St. Bernard water. So we're trying to learn some lessons, unfortunately, from our neighbors. Uh, in terms of how to capture the oil before it gets inland. And uh, how have you been really capturing the oil? How have you been capturing that oil? Well, we, we've been fortunate that it's come It's come in what's called stringers or in, in pieces, if you will. Uh, and we've been able to do it with the help of uh, some of the resources, actually, that were staged in Venice for some time. And um, you know, we're concerned that if we get a full-fledged oil attack like our neighbors we just don't have the resources but that's how we're doing it right now we're trying to catch it as we find it uh, out in the open waters uh, and try to keep it at bay as best we can and in the meantime there are so many people in the seafood industry who are out of work in in st bernard parish there is and, and you know keep in mind that it's just, it's not just the fishermen uh, it's the the suppliers of the of the boats and the fuel docks and and the, the people who repair the boats, who make nets, who, who do all of the things that make fishing a, uh, a part of this community. Uh, and we've been fortunate that, that many of these guys have, have been able to sign on 
and actually work in the oil response right now. But that's that's really not what their livelihood is, and it's certainly not uh, putting the, the same amount of revenue that they would have gotten. But it's something at least to keep them tied over until the until the BP compensation starts to pick up. And in the meantime, you've got the Power to the Parish fundraiser that's going to be put on by Power 102.9, and this is going to help uh, Playground in Violet. Uh, talk about how this money will be used. Well, you know, we uh, we have uh, Violet Park Number Two is is one of the uh, one of the playgrounds in the eastern end of the parish, and and we've uh, we've done some major repairs to that, but. Uh, some some items that are missing are for the for the younger generation and the children, and we'll put the money directly towards uh, playground equipment for that park. So we can't be you know we can't be thankful enough for uh, Power 102.9, and, and we really are appreciative that um, Citadel Broadcasting took the uh, the initiative to do this, and and we're gonna we're gonna declare that uh, on on June 18th, we'd like everyone to uh, to tune in to 102.9 for the day as a as a recognition for what uh, what they're doing for us. How do you feel about that, LeBron? I think that's great. Thank you so much, Mr. President. Thank <laughs> you very much for joining us, Craig Tafaro. And thanks, we, guys. We, we appreciate you. everything you're doing. All right, take care. And joining us right now, Courtney Hart, one of the stars of The Benefit. And I've been seeing your face all over town uh, <laughs> promoting your, your new single. Yeah, my, my boy. My boy. Yes. Well, tell us a little bit. You started singing when you were three years old. Yes, ma'am. And uh, so what are, you, what are your goals? Where are you headed? My goal is actually um, I have a new album. Um, coming out this summer entitled IDK. Um, really, we've been doing a really good job, the team and I, um, just getting my name out yeah. um, in New Orleans and... Yeah, everybody knows you now. <laughs> <laughs> in past New Orleans, so you know, my goal, like you said, everyone to know me. Yeah. And um, one of the big things I do is give back and... Yeah. And this is what you're doing and yeah. taking part in this Power to the Parish benefit. And, and uh, I want you to say a little bit something about Courtney Hart and her her future. Wow, she she's an amazing talent. She um, she certainly has the the gift and the wherewithal, Sally. And and we're just thrilled to death to be able to promote uh, some of our talent. And and it's no big secret to the rest of the world exactly how much talent exists here. Well, look at Treme and all the rest mm -hmm. of this stuff all over the mm -hmm. place. And uh, she's that generation. She's the next generation of that. And she's definitely the truth. We love her to death. All right. And thank we're looking you. forward to hearing Welcome. you sing a little bit later. And <laughs> yeah. thank you so much, LeBron Thank you for Joseph. having us, Sally. It's a pleasure to be here. All right. The Power to the Parish Benefit Concert is Friday night beginning at 9 o'clock at the House of Blues. For more information, you can call this number, 310-4999. And you can also log on to WWLTV.com and click on links on four. And we'll be back with a look at the traffic right after this.